गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू हैव कम्प्लीटेड योर असाइनमेंट नंबर सिक्सटीन वेरी वेल एंड अंडरस्टूड द टॉपिक रेडॉक्स रिएक्शन सो टुडे वी आर ऑन द लास्ट टॉपिक ऑफ दिस चैप्टर कोरोजन एंड रेनसिडिटी विद दिस टॉपिक द चैप्टर वन केमिकल रिएक्शंस एंड इक्वेशंस विल बी कम्प्लीटेड सो टुडे असाइनमेंट नंबर सेवनटीन टॉपिक कोरोजन एंड Rancidity. Let's start with recapitulation. As you have studied in assignment number sixteen, oxidation involves loss of electrons by an element, whereas reduction involves gaining of electron by an element. Oxidation agent undergoes reduction, and reducing agent. undergoes oxidation now coming to today's topic corrosion this topic is having two new terms first one is conversion conversion means to change second new term is undesirable its meaning is unwanted corrosion the process of slow conversion of metals into their undesirable compounds due to their reaction with oxygen water acids gases etc present in the atmosphere is called corrosion example you all have seen rusting of iron now what is rusting iron when reacts with oxygen and moisture it forms a red substance which is called rust here is the chemical equation of rust fe plus o2 plus h2o these are the reactants where fe is iron o2 oxygen h2o water that is water vapors present in air or you may say moisture of the air when react with each other they form rust feo3 xh2o also known as hydrated ferric oxide the rusting of iron is a redox reaction corrosion that is rusting weakens the iron and steel objects and structures such as railings car bodies bridges and ships etc and cuts short their life now here are few methods to prevent rusting you can prevent rusting by painting the surface by applying grease or oil on the surface or by galvanization corrosion of copper copper objects loses their luster and shine after some time because the surface of these objects acquires a green coating of basic copper carbonate and its chemical formula is cuco3 cuoh twice when exposed to air and the chemical reaction goes like this cu copper when reacts with carbon dioxide oxygen and water vapors present in air this all three you may termed as moist air when copper reacts with moist air it produces copper carbonate which is green in color and its chemical formula is cu co3 cu oh twice now corrosion of silver the surface of silver metal gets tarnished it becomes dull it loses its shine and you may have seen the silver ornaments present at your homes they acquire a black coating on them 
when they are exposed to air it is due to the formation of a coating of black silver sulfide on their surface its formula is ag2s it is due to the action of hydrogen sulfide gas h2s present in the air so the equation goes like this ag plus h2s silver when reacts with hydrogen sulfide gives silver sulfide ag2s which is black in color plus hydrogen gas now rancidity the taste and order of food materials containing fat and oil changes when they are left exposed to air for a longer time this change in taste and order is called rancidity it is caused due to the oxidation of fat and oil present in the food materials and when the food is rancid it is no longer good to be consumed methods to prevent rancidity you can prevent the food spoiling or food to be get rancid by adding antioxidants to it by vacuum packing of food by replacing air by nitrogen as you have seen the wafers or the chips you buy from the shops they are having nitrogen gas in them they are very fluffy the air present along with the food item is nitrogen there or you may refrigerate the food stuff as we reduce the temperature the rancid rancidity process also slows down that's why the shopkeepers keep the ice creams keep the other such as other food items such as milk fish meat in refrigerator now here are few questions for you define the following terms corrosion and rancidity write down the chemical equation of the following corrosion of silver and corrosion of copper what are the different methods to prevent rusting of iron and lastly what are the different methods to prevent rancidity with explanation i hope you all are able to answer all these questions and here comes the summary of today's topic corrosion is result of oxidation of metal on exposure to atmosphere rancidity is result of oxidation of food items having fat and oil by painting greasing oiling or galvanization rusting can be prevented rusting of iron is a redox reaction here is homework for you you have to solve assignment number 17 thank you